The following shows how to multiply radicals and then simplify using the prime factorization method. This is particularly good because it doesn't require us to remultiply things. So in this case, we're going to multiply the 2 times the 3 and get the 6. And then inside the, the radical, we're going to have 24 times 21. So what we do is we factor 24, which I'm doing over there on the right. So 24 is 6 times 4, and then 6 is 3 times 3, and 4 is 2 times 2. And then we factor 21. Now what we do is we go identify our pairs. Well, one, our first pair we could see is we got a pair of twos. So we write those two down. The next pair we have is a pair of threes. And notice I'm circling these to make sure I, 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 I don't forget one. And then what's left over is one, two, and one, seven. So we multiply those down. So the prime factorization is two times two times three times three times two times seven. Now we circle the pairs and we identify that we're gonna remove one of those because the square root of two times two is just two and the square root of three times three is three. So we bring those out front, we leave the two and the seven inside, we multiply the front, we end up with 36 times the square root of 14. Okay, for number two, we're going to do the same thing. We multiply the five times the three to get 15. And then we, instead of having to multiply 14 times 42, we're going to go ahead and factor the 14 and the 42 separately. 14 factors very easily to seven times two. 42, we factor to six times seven, and then we factor six to three times two. Now, again, we go identify our pairs. Well, I've got a 2 from the factorization of 14 and a 2 from the factorization of the 6. And so we've got a pair of 2s, and we circle those. And then I've got a pair of 7s, uh, and the only thing I have left over is a 3. So again, we, take, we circle the pair of 2s. That pair of 2s, we're going to bring one of those up front. Again, the reason why is because 2 times 2 is 4, and the square root of 4 is 2. So we're going to have 15 times 2. I circle the 7s. I'm going to bring the, uh, that 7 out front. So 15 times 2 times 7, and then what's left inside is the square root of 3. So I multiply 15 times 2 times 7, and I get 210, and so my answer is 210 times the square root of 3.